Good day, this is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news and reviews. Okay, we have here the F57L smartwatch and this time we are going to set it up, okay, with our H-band support app, okay. So we are going to install this application on the iOS platform or on your iPhone. So we are going to have a demo. Okay, and see if this thing works okay with our iPhone okay with the iOS platform so we are going to install the support app so if you have any questions regarding this video demo with the F57L with it with each band support app on iOS just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if we do have that time okay so let's start installing the support app let's start in setting up the H-band application on our iPhone. So we have here an iPhone, okay? So let's go to the App Store and let's search for the H-band app, okay? So we are not going to scan anymore for the QR code, okay? So we have here the QR code. We are just going directly with the app here. So H-band so let's just search it and identify the icon here okay the logo so we have here and I guess this is the application health and fitness as you can see here again it is the H band support app okay so let's download the application okay so we are now installing the app Okay, so let's wait. Okay, as you can see, it's now downloading. While we are waiting, let's check here. So 3.9 rating, ratings, and it has been updated a week ago. So version 10.36. So it has a good UI here on iOS. And we have so far a good or a positive review here. Okay, more than the average we have 3.9 out of 5 okay so I guess it's done so let's open the application okay start your healthy journey so it requires us to what's this okay so application wants to record your trajectory or getting your location so this is the, our first permission here only while using the app okay each band would like to send you, you notifications. So notifications may include alerts, sounds, and icon badges. So each band would like to send you notifications. Allow it. And if you have here personal information protection and privacy policy. So we'll tap on agree. So forgot forgot your password or sign up, log in. So I guess we need to login okay so we have an option here no account login so if you want to save your data you can create an account but if not if you just want to test and try so let's go with the no account login okay okay so we have here please confirm whether you have carefully read and acknowledge this privacy policy confirm and we have here the UI okay skin color settings let's go for this one next okay we'll just leave it okay wait metric metric okay then just go with it okay so turn on Bluetooth to allow H band to connect to accessories okay so it is activated or not so it's did not activate our bluetooth here as you can see so let's go to our settings here and go to our bluetooth section turn it on 
Okay. Let's activate it. Let's go back to our H band. And let's scan. Let's see. Okay, so so it found our smartwatch. We have here the F57L. But if, if you want to make sure that this is our smartwatch, okay, just swipe here on your smartwatch. Tap on the info. And we have here the MAC address. You see it? Okay. D00918. Okay, I guess this is our smartwatch. So tap on it. And it's now pairing. So Bluetooth pairing request F57L would like to pair with your iPhone. Pair it. Okay, so notification settings directly here. So let's pick. Okay, we'll go with a WhatsApp application here. So it is activated. Okay, let's activate this too. Then confirm. Okay, so let's see if there are some additional settings that we have to set. Okay, each band would like to access and update your health data in the categories below. Okay. Okay, let's just allow it. Then tap on allow. So it is now synchronizing. So as you can see, seems like we have a smooth pairing of our smartwatch to the H band or to the H band application. Okay. So I guess we are paired now. I think we have the dashboard here. Okay, we have the workouts. And we have the mind section here. This is for our device. We have the year, the F57L, steps go, unit settings. Check, let's check out the unit settings. Okay. We have the app style. Let's check on this one. Default style one. What's the style one? Okay, so this is the color. We have the third party platform we run. And that's it. Okay, no other settings for a watch smartwatch. There's no option for the watch face. Okay, as you can see here. So it's just limited when it comes to uh, the setting up of your or personalization of your F57L smartwatch. So for the health data here, we have pedometer, sleep, heart rate, blood pressure, blood oxygen, body temperature. So we have here a mono module manager. So let's tap on this. Okay, more modules. We have, I guess there's no more modules here. Okay, I'm looking for the ECG as well as the blood sugar bar, but there's no option for that. Okay. Go back. I guess that's it for the setting up of your F57L smartwatch with the H band support app. Okay, very easy setup. And so far, there's no conflict when it comes to the setting it up and installing. Okay, that's it. If you have any questions, just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if you do have that time. Bye.